England versus Ireland at the Albert Hall under ABA rules, and here's flyweight D. Lloyd of England in white, getting tangled with Ireland's Johnny Caldwell. Lloyd was the 1955 ABA champion, and Caldwell brought home a bronze medal from Melbourne, so in spite of a clinch or two, there's plenty of action for the fans. Caldwell chases the English boy across the ring with a series of lefts and rights, but Lloyd is fighting back. The two flyweights tear into each other hammer and tongs, but the verdict goes to Lloyd on points. Lord Derby, ABA president, discusses the next bout between lightweight Dick McTaggart in white, England's Olympic gold medalist, and Tony Byrne. Tony won a bronze medal for Ireland at Melbourne, but he's not worried by the difference. Before long, he has McTaggart on his knees, but not for the full count. Dick's tougher than that. McTaggart may have been Melbourne's most stylish boxer, but Burns the sledgehammer type. And for all his style, the English Southpaw has no answer to those swinging rights. Byrne keeps up the pressure, but McTaggart gets a few in on his own account. If the Irishman had just a little more power behind those punches, he might finish McTaggart. Altogether, a mighty near thing, but it ends in a points victory for the battering bakery salesman from Ireland, Tony Byrne.